Welcome back to Variety with John and Anna. We have today with us Anna, Misty, and John. So we're going to have another segment right now called Weird But True. And we got these uh, facts from strangefacts.com. Woohoo! Weird but true. Okay, Anna, you'll <laughs> go first, right? Yes, okay. So this I didn't get from strangefacts.com. I got it from the Snapple Facts. You know how when you open a Snapple box, mm. excuse, me, excuse me, a Snapple bottle, there's a fact on the top. Fun Snapple so Facts. This says, if you line up all the streets in New York City, it'll stem all the way to China. Holy That's crap. That's so crazy. Wow. So many That's crazy. And I never think of New York City being that big. Like, it looks what? small to Well, they me. have so many streets. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, but you're talking about with Brooklyn, all the boroughs all and everything? All the boroughs in oh, okay. New York City, okay. all the streets. Okay, I was thinking just like Manhattan. Manhattan, like Times Square, Manhattan, you know, like right in that. I wasn't thinking like all the boroughs, like oh, Brooklyn yeah. and the Bronx, but yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. That's big. So all the way to China. Yes, yeah, so if you them just line up. them up one after another after another, it stems all the way to China. Wow. That's so crazy. So that would be impossible to like go down every street in like a day. <laughs> no, no. I mean, who would want to really, but it would be impossible. Your feet would be killing you. You'd yeah. probably die. Well, even in a car, <laughs> yeah, that's true. But even in a car, that'd be impossible to yeah. do. Like go down every single street. And plus, a lot of them are one ways, so yeah. it would be endless. And you're like, wait a minute, let me take a left here. Yeah. You gotta take it right here. Mm -hmm. Because I wanna go down this street. Yeah. I wanna go down that street. That's People true. die of exhaustion. <laughs> Okay, Misty Gallo, what do you got? Okay, this I got from strangefacts.com. Men are six times more likely to be struck by lightning than women. Whoa. Whoa. So what is that saying about us? That says That's we're dumb? That's saying something about you why. guys. That must be saying we're yeah. dumb or something. I don't know. Cause I don't know. What does that mean? Like, why would a lightning want to attract to, to a guy versus a girl? Because we're heavenly creatures as women. <laughs> That's that, crazy. That, that could be it. But I wonder I don't if like know. men have a certain chemical that, that they have more of than women that makes them more. You know. It's probably because we have wieners. It has to be that. <laughs> You're it's it's a You're wiener like thing. Or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I want to strike a person with a wiener. Okay. So <laughs> <laughs> my strange fact, also from strangefacts.com, on our weird but true, is tourists visiting Iceland should know that tipping there is considered an insult. Ooh. Wow. 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 I, I would wow. love going there. I'm yeah, like, I'm like, what? Uh, if I tip you, is that insult? I'm not tipping. Wow. <laughs> but that's weird, wow. right? Like, why would that be insulting to, for somebody to give you money? But I Especially guess every customer. Especially when you're a server, because servers live on tips. That's how they, that's their bread and butter when it comes to the money for the day. It might be different out there, though. So Maybe I'm guessing. They might, they might be caking out there. Maybe. That's the true. Hours. I'm guessing in Iceland, they probably make more money. Than probably. we do here. They probably don't pay him three dollars an hour like they do the here. Or maybe the tips are already included in the bill. Or maybe they just don't do tips at all. They must not do like, tips. I don't know. If that's considered that's an weird. insult. Wow. Yeah, that is crazy. I think that's weird. Okay, Anna, your next one. Let's see. So, in your lifetime, for the average person, an average person will eat up to ten spiders in their whole life. Uh, how I know. gross. And you know, like when you're uh, sleeping, you'll sleep with your mouth open, like, a spider will crawl in, or you're eating some spaghetti, and you're like, oh, I gotta get a drink. And like you run and get your drink, and then a spider creeps in there, and then you, you know, stir it up, and like, you know, you think the spider's an herb or something. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> Once you stir now, it up. Now tell me, be honest, Misty, do you really think that you've ever eaten a spider in your life? Maybe as a kid. Maybe as a kid, because you know how kids are, I dare you, I dare you. <laughs> like, I don't know, but I personally don't remember ever eating a spider. Like, I don't, I hope I would. That's crazy. Yeah, we don't gross. know it. Usually like, it happens in our sleep or where we're not paying attention. We better hope that you don't eat a poisonous spider because you don't you wake know up. How, um, like, fast food. How you know little ant, little you know okay. bugs will sneak in? Oh, don't freak me oh. out because I might go yes. have a burger one day. So that I don't know. Your next one. Okay. Slugs have four noses. Can you oh picture that? God. Like they don't even look like they have anything. They just look like nothing. They're just. And wait, why would you need four noses? Why did God give slug four noses? For what? 
unless they don't have eyes. So maybe the, maybe the noses help it's them. like their sense. Yeah. But why do you need four? Like yeah. one, I would think would be enough. Wouldn't you? Yeah. But like it's weird because they don't look like they have anything right. at all. Like it's just a long slimy thing. Wow. Let's see. Another one that I got also from strangefacts.com. Uh dolphins dolphins sleep with one eye open. Wow. They don't trust anybody. <laughs> I guess not. You know when they say They have to watch for them sharks. You mm, know. That's true. And dolphins are tough. Yeah. Like and they're mm -hmm. friendly. Friendly and tough. And I was watching on a National Geographic show a while ago that, like, a dolphin could beat a shark, like, in yeah. a fight because their tail is so, you know, powerful. That's the only thing out there, I think, that they say can beat a shark. Yeah. A and that's funny how they're so lovable yeah. and, and sharks are so evil. And like, also, they want to kill people, but dolphins love people. Mm -hmm. So, but I mean, I mean, I'm sure there are killer dolphins out there because we've heard of them. But in general, they're very, like, people ride yeah. dolphins and Friendly, they pet them. Friendly, happy. Yeah. I also so. heard that dolphins are, like, the only animal that goes both ways sexually. Oh, I've read that, Wait, too. Which is interesting. interesting. Dolphins are bisexual? Yeah. I've read that. Yeah. I've heard that before. That's true. Weird so. but true. Yeah, they don't, they don't discriminate. Damn. Like, <laughs> and you shouldn't. You should not. <laughs> Okay, your next one, Mr. Gallo. Okay, this is kind of weird. It was once against the law to slam your car door in a city in Switzerland. Like, oh so I'm going to go to jail. I'm like, Bob, damn it, you're making me so mad. And then you slam <laughs> your car door. door. That's it, I'm going to jail. <laughs> Bob's going to call the cops on you. Like, she said, ma'am, my, my girlfriend just slammed the car door on me. <laughs> Come and get her. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. And That's Spain. crazy. That's crazy. Like, but who really sat down and thought about I that? I know. Like, like you, you don't know have what? better rules to make up than that. Yeah, like, like we don't want we don't want to encourage people slamming their car doors, so we're just gonna put a law against it. Okay. That's crazy. That is crazy. Okay, I got a fun one for you. The sentence, the following sentence I'm about to say uses every letter of the alphabet. You guys ready? It's the quick brown fox jumps over a lazy dog. That uses every letter of the alphabet. That's Isn't that so crazy? Bad. And that's, that's not crazy. even like a long sentence. No. no. And, and you would never think. No. Yeah. You wouldn't every think every letter that of the alphabet. The whole alphabet in there. The quick brown fox jumps over a lazy dog. So um, write that down. Check it out. So. Weird but true. Weird but, Weird true. but true. And your last one, Miss Hall. A sneeze travels out of your mouth over 100 miles per hour. Holy crap. That fast? That's crazy. That's like, but that's, that's <laughs> too fast. That's way too fast. That's some wind power there. That is. So I didn't even think we were capable of doing anything at 100 miles per hour. I know. No, I know. That's nuts. And your last one? It's illegal to drink beer out of a bucket while you're sitting on a curb in St. Louis. First of all, <laughs> who is going to drink a beer out of a bucket? And who thought of that to be like, you know what? I'm just going to make this law real quick as I drink my beer. That is <laughs> you crazy. can't drink out of a bucket I mean, while you're sitting on a curb. Yeah, yeah. Be heavy too, okay? But it must That's have happened because they don't come up with laws unless something happened. Right. Like they might were people just sitting around on curbs, like drinking out of buckets. Like that's weird. That's just weird. That is weird. Okay, our last thing on our weird but true is a cockroach can live several weeks with its head cut off, mm. and it only dies of starvation. Yeah, I've heard that's that crazy. too. Cockroach and it's not even forever. dying because oh, it's not even dying because its head is cut off. It's dying because it can't eat because it has no head to eat with. That's ridiculous. Yeah, that's crazy. Cockroaches are something else. Like they, they can survive during a nuclear explosion mm -hmm. and everything. Listen, they were here before us. They're they will be, be here, here after, after us. us. Yep. Absolutely. Wow. Well, I hope you guys had fun watching that. That was our weird but true segment.